this. This is a special family event for us. It's our first ever giving opportunity to give uh, publicly. Uh, we were able to give out a lot of money last year and we're really proud of what we've been able to do. This is a big piece for the two of us because it really gives us an opportunity to give back. And uh, I don't know if Mary Beth wants to add anything before you guys ask any questions. Uh, no, I just think you know, Kirby and I have been so blessed and the University of Georgia has blessed us so much and so we're just thankful to have this opportunity to give back. Kirby, what the idea for this conference? Where did this originate? Well, I think anytime you have an opportunity to give back, you certainly want to do that. So a lot of head coaches in college football nowadays have foundations, uh, family foundations. It gives us a chance to teach our kids. And if you have an opportunity to give back, you certainly want to do that. And with every blessing comes a burden, and you got to kind of own that. And we've been very blessed, so we've got the burden to give back, and it's really important to us that we're able to do it. Now, we wouldn't be able to do it without our foundation members, and it's certainly uh, very helpful that we get to do that. How do you go about choosing you know, who you help, how you help, and that kind of um, well, you want me to answer that? Yeah. We've got a few special causes that mean a lot to us. Um, his brother had cancer as a young child, so we are kind of seeking out some organizations that, that deal with childhood cancer specifically. But other, our mission statement is helping children and families in need. Um, and most of those are local, within the state of Georgia, um, and, and in our community here. You know, we have a website for it, the Kirby Smart Family Foundation, where anybody can apply for that, those monies and put an application in. That's part of us having this event is to make sure that we make that public. Your thought, thoughts on the response from the fans and just uh, the Georgia Nation in terms of the support you've already gotten? Yeah, we get a ton of support. We have an opportunity for people that want to get an autographed football. They can send in through the website and uh, pay a real small fee, but that, that money goes directly to our foundation. So we're able to give back to so many in the community through that. And Dog Nation's been supportive of everything we've done as athletes and also as parents and as family. I saw Devon Gale up here. Uh, yeah. had the groundbreaking the other day. Is that another thing that the foundation has kind of uh, helped support him and stuff? Yeah, that's really important to us. Devon's part of our family now. We've taken on um, an opportunity to give back to his family so that they can have a home. And they're going to be able to have a home. Of course, Rick Marshall did a tremendous thing and gave a, a lot and Evan able to build his home. And we wanted to help contribute to that as well. Do you have a vision for this, like, you know, five, ten years down the road where you want this to be? I and mean, is this part of your legacy? Is that's a hard, I mean, that's a hard question. I feel like we're just kind of getting our feet wet, and um, and it is growing, and um, and we're really excited about that. So it's just, I'm excited about where it is now, and anything we can do to improve on it in the future will be tremendous. Absolutely. Thank you guys for coming out. Appreciate y'all coming. Thank you. Thank y'all.